Hello everyone, today we will be talking about the great architect, Richard Meyer. Richard Meyer was born on October 12, 1934 in Newark, New Jersey, USA. Richard Meyer graduated from Cornell University in 1957. After graduating, Meyer traveled to Greece, Germany, France, Denmark, Finland, and Italy, among other places, to network with architects. Meyer was known for many great iconic architectural buildings, and here are four of them. Number one is the Museum of the Ara Paces in Rome. This museum houses the Roman monumental altar dedicated to the Roman peace goddess. Number two is the High Museum of Art in Atlanta, Georgia. The High Museum of Art is a museum of fine and applied arts with a 17,000 piece collection and buildings by Richard Meyer and Renzo Piano. Number three is the MACBA. It is a museum of modern and contemporary art in Barcelona, housed in an iconic building located in the Ravel district. And lastly, the Getty Center. The Getty Center in Los Angeles is the venue of the Getty Museum, dedicated to the art from the Middle Ages to the 1900s. Among all of his great architectural achievements, in this video, we will focus on two specific buildings. Number one, the MACBA, which stands for the Barcelona Museum of Contemporary Art. The museum is located in the heart of the capital city of Catalonia. Meyer designed this building in a shape of a large box, clad in white enamel painted steel panels, flanked by a circular pavilion on its west end, which accommodates the visitor's entrance and services, and a semi-detached wing on the east end, housing additional gallery spaces and staff offices. The main entrance is parallel to the pedestrian, and that it defines a gentle curve, and this movement is a movement of centrifugal hole, connecting the geometries of the museum with its urban contacts that is characterized by scooped intersections and the vaults of the old church. The level of the main entrance rises through a ramp parallel to the facade one meter above the Plaza de Los Angeles. Past the gates, visitors enter the cylinder area of the reception that creates a circle that is intertwined geometric holes of the museum with rectilinear blocks of the city. The glass wall parallel to the ramp also helps to filter the natural light that comes from the house. This curtain wall on the facade of the building lets you see the whole of the plaza. The main materials used in the structure of this building are concrete, aluminum and white glass. Number 2. The Getty Center the Getty Center is one of the two venues of the Getty Museum in Los Angeles, together with the Getty Villa. While the villa is focused on ancient art, the Getty Center is dedicated primarily to European and American art from the Middle Ages to the 20th century. The Getty Center is built upon a centralized axis. The Getty Center is housed since 1997 in a large modernist complex located within a 110-acre site in the Printwood neighborhood, on a hill overlooking the Los Angeles west side in the Santa Monica Mountains area. Throughout the complex, landscaping integrates the buildings into the topography with garden sequences extending beyond the enclosed volumes. All buildings are organized along two axes, which on one hand follow the rigid topography of the site, and on the other hand ideally extend the street grid of Los Angeles. Most buildings in the compound are travertine stone-clad constructions with a load-bearing structure made of steel beams and columns. 
The museum's interior space is filled with natural light, entering through many full high openings regulated by a computer system of louvers and shades to provide the galleries and the artworks on display with their correct level of illumination. Overall, Richard Meyer's project admirably combines architecture and nature into a coherent whole. In a sense, it looks like the Getty Center was conceived as an ideal town, a calm and relaxing urban microcosm from which to look at the huge, sprawling city below.